no mystery charts this week, but we do have the methodology in action. This was a recommendation not that long ago. SVM silver's been pretty hot. It was in a nice uptrend. It pulled back to the 30 EMA, and then it began to rally out. There were the parameters down there. Entry of 350, stop of 285. IPT of 415. So the entry was here, stop was down here, and the IPT was right here. Now, what I did was I had a, initially I had a limit order at the IPT, and I'm going to show you just one minute where I applied a tiny bit of discretion. But anyway, you can see I, I ended up with right about 414, maybe 414 and a half on the trade, minus 354 was the entry. My entry was a little bit higher. I'm not sure exactly why. I have to go back and look at my trading journal. I guess I should have done that before the presentation. But probably because it might have spiked up a little bit and came back in, and I might have used a little bit of discretion on that entry. But anyway, so I didn't get the full 1000 bucks on the half first half of the loaf. Your, your goal is to make 2% per 100K on the first loaf. And this is what I like to call my model account, where I, I model the trades that I talk about in the trading service but anyway so that's the trades down there you can see initially 3,000 to open and then we peeled off 1500 i peeled off 1500s that's how it worked out with the p l now by the way once you hit that initial profit target your stop comes to break even now i did trail this up a little bit before it was hit that was a question last week do i trail one for one before the initial profit target is hit and as a general statement yes but in more recent years, I've been a little bit more lenient. And if you go in and look at the archives, davelearn.com slash archives, so you can go in and see how I did nudge the stop up a little bit, but not quite one-to-one -one on the first load.